But wait, there's more. Here we are today on day three of Sci-Fi in the Rock 2023. I am, of course, still here with Kelsey, but she had a... Well, I do too. I was at a, at a different shirt underneath, so that was my big change. But I think uh, Kelsey has done a little bit more with I hers. Have. Can you tell everybody what you've done today? So today I'm dressed as Raya from Raya and the Last Dragon. It's and, a Disney movie. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to pan yeah. down a little bit because this is a this is a full full gear. Oh God! <laughs> uh, there we go. This is right down right down to the boots and everything. Now I got to try and get this back up to the right side. Uh, I think I'm going to be crouching for the rest of this one. Yeah. No. <laughs> this is what happens when you don't have a helper. Cool. All right. So. I mean, we've we've gone over the questions yesterday, so now I'm just gonna let you go over everything because this is this is very intense. This one. It is. So the costume, like yesterday, is purchased. Okay. Uh, I don't have the space, like we already said. Mm -hmm. However, this sword, Raya's dragon sword, was built by me. Very cool. Uh, I found a template and video tutorial online by SKS Props. Big shout out to him. It was great. Uh, so basically, this is just underneath a, a bit of PVC piping to about here mm -hmm. uh, with a coupler here so that way the sword can attach. Okay. So then, because she's got a different weapon, doesn't she? Yes. So in the film, she's able to turn the blade into like this whip. So at a later date, I do want to build that whip. Mm. Just, I didn't get the time to finish it. <laughs> All I'm hearing is excuses, Kelsey. That's yeah. all I'm hearing. I, I tried. <laughs> I just I ran into con crunch. It's true. Now this I just want to. in like three days. Can I see it for a second? Because yeah. I just want to show. So it's very light because you were saying yes. earlier this is made from EVA foam as well, the blade. Yeah. But I just want to try and get this as close as I can. So you can actually see that the design there is somewhat etched in. And I had to ask about it before. So what was the technique that you used for that? So I used a like a box cutter blade. Okay. Uh, and I hand drew the design. Then I carved it out just lightly, and then I used the heat gun to just open up the uh, little scars, and then that's what caused it to spread. That's so yeah. cool. And then during the painting process to help highlight, I just went back over with black paint. Very good. Yeah. And that goes to show because it's not, and again, like you were saying, like you were kind of bummed, like I did buy this one, but then obviously, like how long did it take you to make this? Because this is this is where a lot of your time went. So the base took about three sessions each session was about three four hours long mm -hmm. and then the painting was all done in one day because it was a lot Blech. of dry brush oh, okay yeah uh, but all of the details was four days wow <laughs> yeah, all of these little details which all of this was individually put on mm -hmm. uh took three days total because you had to let it all dry and it was very tedious. Like, See, yeah. this is it. It's not for everyone. It is for it's everyone. Not. Do it. But this is this is cool because this is the like we've seen varying degrees. It's all cosplay. It doesn't matter what you do. If you put an ear on, it's cosplay in some yes. way, shape, or form. And this is going to the part where everyone can see. Like there'll be pictures that'll be posted by both Sci-Fi and uh, the Historic Theorist. There's uh, about some of these insane cosplays that we've seen of these full-on EVA foam suits that people are mm -hmm. walking around. And you've seen the power armor from Avalon Expo last year. And I know there's gonna be one that we're gonna be doing here. It's it's the one that I'm seeing today is so intense that the person actually can't talk. So I have to make up the lines Ooh. for them, which is gonna be very intense for that one. Um, so, but yeah, this is, this is part of one of the, this is part of cosplay. It, again, like I said, it could be an ear, it could be simple as sometimes mm -hmm. buying your costume, it could be making your sword, or it could be completely covering yourself up in some way, shape or form. It's all parts of this. And like this is, I, I love seeing it. I love, I love doing these interviews because I get to see all the ranges and how pe how happy that makes people when they're doing this. Yeah. Because you are, you're not proud of this at all, are you? Not at <laughs> not all. Not at all. No, nah, this is just something I threw on today because I was yeah. bored. Very bored. Yeah, just Did made this last this night. At all. This is a quick twenty minute sword that I yeah. threw together. <laughs> so. And again, like this is right down to the boots yeah. and everything too. So was that all part of the same purchase? Did it all come as yes. one? Okay, cool. Yeah. Again, everything, even the wig, the hat. All came from the same uh, company. I don't know where it was a gift. Fair so, enough. Yeah. I that's... didn't have to buy this one. <laughs> Aha, see, and that's how it happens. You make enough connections. Thank you, Mom. <laughs> <laughs> make enough connections with your parents, kids, because they'll help you out. Yeah. Um, sorry, and like, the, like we had talked about yesterday about all the different cosplays that like people are looking forward to do, and we knew about this one, 
So this is you've got a big repertoire now. Yes. So and now you've you've started with this. So you, you're still going to start yeah. building your. I was, start building and I'm going to expand from there. Excellent. Yeah. So hopefully we're going to see something bigger and better next year. And even if hopefully. we don't, we're still happy to, to have yes. you around to do all this stuff as always. Yeah. So again, from the Distort Theorist and Sci-Fi and the Rock 2023, we thank you for stopping by. Thank Make you. Make sure to subscribe, like, share, comment down below. Let us know what you think. T tell us about your own cosplays. Mm -hmm. Send pictures. We're on Facebook. We're on all the socials and everything. So from the Distort Theorist, I'm Peter Parkour here with Kelsey Taylor showing off her Raya from The Last Dragon. Raya and The Last Raya Dragon. Raya and The Last Dragon. <laughs> She is not the last dragon, is she? I haven't seen the movie. Don't don't come for me in the comments. <laughs> but I'm Peter Parkour, the Distorted Theorist. Like we always say around here, keep it real. <laughs>